Hi everyone. So recently I found out why I didn't have the option to convert my CMG from the classic service to the VM scale set. So now I know how to do it, let's give it a go. So from these uh, plethora of CMGs that I've accrued over the past few days, this one here is running my custom domain and has a cloud service deployment method. By comparison, uh, this one is using the cloud app and has the cloud service as well. This one doesn't have the option to convert. It should be here. And this one does have the option to convert. It's right there. So let's see what happens when we try to convert. I'm going to click convert. All right. So I guess it's a case of choosing next. It's hidden by my taskbar here because it's quite a big taskbar. I'm just going to choose next by hitting enter. And it's asking me for, I can't change this. I can't change the cert that I used. I can't change any of this. Um, I guess I can update this from classic to VMSS, virtual machine scale set. Uh, I can't change the region, which is not ideal because it was in the, the only region that made sense. Central US is probably as close as you can get to the UK. Um, I can change the VM size though, because we've got new VM size. I'm going to go with lab, to just save a little bit of money. And I guess I could untake these if I needed to change that. But for now, I'm just going to go to next. And, you know, that that's, looks about right. I've just set all that stuff, so we'll just choose next again. And, right. Well, that was easy. Um, let's take a look what the console says behind that wizard. Uh, it, let's refresh this, upgrading, it's changed the VM scale set, fantastic. Now obviously there's, there's there's been some changes that have happened with this VM scale set because it's going to be using a different deployment model and therefore a different cloud service name. So let's just jump in to the properties of it. Let's jump into settings. And you can see the, the deployment name, which used to be uh, cloudapp.net, very simple, is now centralus.cloudapp.azure.com. So the DNS that I created when I created my um, the cloud app version will be wrong because I've, I've got a C name within this domain which points to gmcmg002.cloudapp.net, and that's not going to work. So while this is upgrading, I'm going to go ahead and just change that C name to point at the new name, which is centralus.cloudapp.azure.com. So in my DNS, scroll down a little bit, we have this cloudapp.net one. So it's gmcmg002.cloudapp.net, like I sh just mentioned earlier on. I'll just choose edit. And it's still the host name, it's still correct. And that that first bit is correct, but it's dot um, centralus dot cloud app dot azure dot com and just save that back over to the server and that is possibly all we need to do it it's going to be doing a lot of upgrading a lot of stuff because it's essentially it's essentially changing from the classic service which uses the old model for VMs to the new service and when I've created a few of these in the past these VM scale set services it's taken roughly 20 25 minutes for it to do all of the stuff in the background to create that so what I'm going to do now is I'm not going to make you wait while that happens. I'll just speed that up for you and we'll come back in about 25 minutes. Ah, it said error. Let's take a look. Right, well, here we go. Um, I don't even know how to, how to handle that error. It gives me nothing in the status. Let's just... It's still upgrading. Okay. Let's hope that error was. Let's hope that error was transient, um, and that it's still upgrading. We're going to give it twenty-five minutes and come back to it, and see you then. Okay. So as you can see, it's switched to ready. So we're ready to just go in and do the connection analyzer and see how it goes. So just right click and choose connection analyzer. We'll sign in as Lucy Tester again. 
Just click start. Ah, and the connection points. Uh, of course, no, I haven't done that. Yes, yeah, so the connection points here is blank. I haven't connected a connection point for this. I moved this one off during a different video. So, um, yeah, fine, good. Let's jump into sites and services. Sorry, servers and site system rules. Right click on this and just switch that connection point over to my uh, 02 CMG. You can only have one connection point, one CMG connected to each connection point. Okay. Now that we've done that, I need to I need to synchronize the configuration um, and give that a few minutes to upgrade, and we'll come back. Okay, it's given us a couple of minutes, so to refresh, and it's ready to go. Okay, the moment of truth. Just sign in as Lucy Tester once again. And we'll choose start. And six green ticks. Okay, that's all I needed. So, that is how you convert a CMG from the classic to the VM skill set. See you next time.